Hey guys, we're back with another video. What's up with this? Today we are doing a Shop Miss A haul slash Amazon haul. Now I bought a lot of stuff from Shop Miss A a couple of months ago and I did make a video but then I didn't post it because I just didn't edit it. And so let's get into it. So Shop Miss A, we'll do Shop Miss A first because that's the stuff that I bought most stuff from. Um, I probably bought, let me think, Canadian, so Shop Miss A is US, so everything's in US dollars, but you can convert it, so once it's converted, I think at that time everything for me was a dollar twenty-three, if I'm not mistaken, right now it's probably like a dollar thirty-two, something like that, I don't know, but I bought this like back in November. <laughs> And, or it wasn't even November, it was before that. I know I bought, like, it was like 72 items and it was like 90 some odd dollars because I had a $100 MasterCard gift card that I used to order it and I didn't use all of it, but I used most of it. Um, and it didn't really take long. It took, I'd say probably a month, but I was, you know, I was expecting it to take that long. So it wasn't so bad. Um, and I did get everything. There was only one thing that was broken, which kind of sucked, but because it kind of went over everything. But other than that, everything came in pretty good. So the first, I did get a couple of other jewelry items, but some of them are at home still because, um, you know, I'm in an apartment now. Um, some of them are still at home, and then one of the items I gave to my mom for Christmas. So these are the first things that I got. These are just cute little earrings. Stuff like that. They kind of look like little snowmen. A necklace. I got a couple of necklaces. They're really pretty. And I got this one. I got what that one looks like. Here's the other one. I really like that one. That one's really pretty. And then I got this one. Oh my god, it's so tangled. Yeah, this is this is really nice. It's six chains. It's just it's really nice to just lay like this. So it's really nice to just lay like that. Um, I find it's kind of a pain, but then I figured out um, what? What baby? I don't know if this is like another chain here that was supposed to be on, but it kind of broke off, so I just kind of use it to make it longer or shorter if I want it to be. It's the baby. Oh, the other one's up. This is Louie. Hey, hi. Louie. Hi. He's not happy at all. He's not happy at all. No. No. Look at this. Now let's get into the makeup. So I'm going to tell you guys I bought so much freaking makeup it is unreal first thing we have which i was actually really surprised that they had this is just an elf brush so it's their eyeshadow brush um, um then i got a beauty blender oh my fuck i don't wear foundation very often as you guys can tell but i don't give a fuck because it's sunday and i don't care um <laughs> this beauty blender this is the black one and it's all full of fur because i think my cats decided to play with it this is just a black beauty blender, and I'm going to tell you guys, this thing is freaking amazing. I bought ones from Amazon, and they were like $3.99, and they just didn't, like they did, but they didn't really, they did not feel like this at all. Like this is so soft, even when it's like not filled with water, it's so soft. And when it's filled with water, it, it, like it's, it's really big, like it gets huge. And it's amazing, like, I, I love this a lot. If I wore foundation all the time, I would definitely be getting one of these. But I got one anyway, <laughs> I mean, like I said, I don't wear foundation a lot, but when I do, I definitely like to have a beauty blender that works well. Next thing that I got was a eyeshadow primer. Now this thing is freaking huge, like, it's, pr it's about the size of my hand, and it's massive, it has zero, 0.63 fluent ounces with matte eyeshadow. This is by Clean Color, and it's actually really good. Like, I tried it a while ago, and it actually did make my eyeshadow stay for a very long time, which I was very surprised about. So I'm happy with that. Then I got a waterproof eyeliner. It's by Malibu Glitz. It says intense color on long wear, and that is true. It definitely gives long wear. Um, the only problem is, is that it's matte which I didn't realize at the time, uh, maybe I did, I don't know. Um, I don't know, it's matte and I find that it doesn't make everything look as good. Then I got my lip liner by LA Colors in burgundy. It's like that, that, really nice color I must say. It does last kinda long, kinda. 
I've got these two. These are by Santee. Um, they're liquid foundations and they both have 1.2 fluid ounces. Um, Makeup Flawless Bare. Woo. These are actually pretty good. Like They don't give you crazy coverage, but they're not bad at all. So this one's in the number 5, which is dark, which really does not match my skin tone at all. Um, and this one's number 1, which really doesn't match my skin tone at all either. But if you mix them, they're not so bad. And then I thought that if I mixed more of this one with this one in the summertime, then it would match my skin very well. Then I decided to go and buy, this is by Santee again, um, by the Beauty Face by Santee. It's Mineral Loose Powder. I decided to try this because I like Mineral Loose Powder a lot. Um, so I tried it and it does work very well, I, but that's kind of what it looks like. So yeah, the Beauty Face Mineral Powder is very good. I really like it. Then I got some pressed powder. This is Face Powder by Malibu Glitz. And it just looks like this with a mirror, which is cool. And this is, I don't remember what color this is in. Probably light. These are by Malibu Glitz as well. So I have the pow the thingy still in them because they come with these um, but I just put them in there just to protect them so there's this color like you can see the camera wow um, so yeah it just comes like those are the really pretty flowery color and it's really cute but I'm not really sure what color this is in number it says number four but I don't remember I think it's like rose or something Malibu glitz I cannot say that it's just it's a tongue twister this one I really love and this one's in a gray package which I found kind of weird same thingy like, see, I just, like, slap my face. And it's, like, on my face. <laughs> and it's crazy. So this is the, like, look at it. It's crazy. It's crazy, but we didn't. I just slap my face. Like, that's crazy. But anyway, this is the color. I do like it. But you can't use a lot of it because it gets that. Like, it's crazy. Sorry. I lied. <laughs> this one is by Starry. Oh, my God, guys. Starry is, like, the best brand on this freaking page like it's m amazing you guys definitely need to try Staria. this blush is massive but it's really pretty um and the packaging is really nice too so this is the packaging that, i'll open it up for you guys so that's what it looks like the color it's very very pigmented like very pigmented girls talk number three this is my clean color so this is a palette that like a palette a palette what there's a lot of colors and i use like this one for a highlighter and i actually just take my brush sometimes and just go Phew, and then use it as a highlighter and it works and some of them like some of them are pigmented some of them not so much but i mean it was a buck so like it's a big palette like it's bigger than my hand so this is another starry product it's the boutique colors this palette is amazing oh my God. it does have a little mirror in it which is kind of cute look at that mirror and then these are the colors. The colors are crazy. Like, the colors are so pigmented. If you guys want to see swatches, let me know because I will do swatches. But I'm not doing swatches in this video because it's going to be, like, an hour-long video if I do swatches. So just let me know if you guys want to see swatches because I have lipsticks, too. Um, so, yeah, these colors are very pigmented. I love them so much. They're amazing. The Clean Color Femme Advice eyeshadow palette, so it just looks like this. It has eight colors in it, and it has a mirror in the back, which I didn't actually know about till like, a couple weeks ago. But yeah, these colors are not so bad. They are pretty pigmented. They're not crazy pigmented, but they're not bad. This little palette by Malibu Glitz. Um, so this is what it looks like. I'll close it. That's what it looks like. Open. It has a little mirror here, and then I think this is eyeshadow primer, because... It's like creamy. Muse Perfect Duo eyeshadow. I Perfect Duo 2. Perfect Duo. And these colors are really pigmented. So this, this palette is pretty good. It's really small. But it would be really good to travel with. So it has like a little mirror and a little applicator here that I'm holding. Um, and it's got black, white, some browns, other colors. These are pretty pigmented, I must say. The Rari eyeshadow palette. It's like a bow. It's really cute. Um, it has a mirror, again. Again with the mirror. So that's the mirror. These colors, like, they're really small to get at, um, but they're so pigmented. Like, it's crazy. They're really pretty colors. I love them so much. Like, so then we have the LA Colors Matte Eyeshadow, which I don't mind. Like, it's not crazy pigment, but it's nice for matte palette. Because I don't have any really matte colors, but that's just one 
I know I said I wasn't going to do any swatches, but I just wanted to show you guys that. So I use these a lot. I use this one a lot for, like, just a regular eye. So I would use, like, this for the lid and this for, like, the crease and then that for, like, the outer corner or whatever. Um, but it's really pretty. I don't mind it. This Giovi palette, which I'm going to tell you guys, do not get the Giovi palette because it sucks. So it looks like this. Um, and it's, like I said, it's not the greatest palette ever. The pigment is not good at all. Um, I mean, it was worth a try, though. So, nice try, Giovi. So then the next thing I have is Malibu, Malibu Glitz again. Um, these ones are actually pretty pigmented, I must say. So it looks like that. And then these are the colors. This palette, it was the worst of them all, I must say. This is by Clean Colors. It's the KC Eyeshadow Trio. These ones, they, I'm gonna tell you, suck so bad. Um, they're not pigmented at all. So some princesses stuff is really good, but this one isn't so much. The pigment is okay, but I just don't like the colors. So this is print by Princessa. It has an applicator in it. So that's the applicator. Um, it has eight colors. So it has th four here and then four down here with a little mirror. Um, the colors, they're okay, but they're not the greatest thing ever. Six kit eyeshadow. Um, palette by Santee from Sexy Color. It doesn't have a mirror in it, but they are very creamy eyeshadows. Like, these eyeshadows are probably the best eyeshadows ever. Um, so it got some, it has a bunch of different colors and they're really pretty. It comes with the applicator. Um, definitely, definitely these are like the best. So this is the other one that they had, which I really love. Like, these palettes are like, they're so creamy like they're they're just so creamy um and i love them like these ones are too and these ones are by santi as well which i love um these are silky touch six shadows which are basically i think the same as these except these ones are bigger so these are what those look like um and they are a shadow palette like it says it does come with a little mirror down here and it comes with the applicator so these are all the colors for this one this will make some grays and blacks, and that's where my finger went in right there. Um, and this is the other one, so I've got two of them. This is the other Santee Silky Touch 6 eyeshadow palette. Um, and then, like I said, comes with the applicator again, and then the mirror, and then these are these colors. So we have some pinks, grays. This one's really cool because it looks like a red right here when you look at it, but it, then it has like a green tint to it so cool and it's really pretty but I think it's, it is more of a here I'll just swatch this one for you it has a green tint to it but it's like actually red um so this is the amuse smoky eye which I bought two of these so these are the single palette ones I'll open that so there's not so much glare uh, this one looks like a mustard it's in brown burn which I thought was going to be more of like a brown color like a gold color but it's not, and it's kind of ugly, and I'm almost tempted to throw it out. <laughs> and then I got another one like this, but it was like in a brown, brown color, but that one was the one that broke. I only got two of the Princessa ones, which I might actually go back on it on Shop Missy and get more, which I've attempted to for the last three, four months. <laughs> um, but I just don't have the money right now. So we have, these are Princessa eyeshadows. These, this one is an 857, and then the other one's an 841. So 857, so they just look like this, but they are so pretty. Like, I don't know if you guys will be able to see this on camera, but they do have like a diamond shimmer to them. Oh, yeah, you can kind of see it a little bit, but they have a little diamond shimmer, and it's so pretty. This one is in 841, and it's like a purpley brown, but it has the same like diamond texture in it, which is so pretty. Then I got the, this is by Amuse, Amuse. Like, these are amazing. Like, oh my god. This is in Cute Twinkle. So, they're like the little pods that look like this. Um, and they're... This one's in Brownie, but it's almost like a pigment, but not an eyeshadow. But it is an eyeshadow. Like, it's crazy. So, it comes with a little thing like this with a little applicator that just decided to jump out and kill me. But look at this. Like, look at this. Like, it's crazy. It's so creamy. It's amazing. Like, so if you guys want like a pigment, but it's an eyeshadow, if you guys just want pigments in general, definitely go to Shop Miss A because I'm gonna tell you this stuff is freaking amazing. I love it so much. Then, 
I have these two things from Princess. So these are just little, it says pearl powder. So there's this one, and there's this one. So these are eyeshadows, supposedly, by Princessa. So I might as well show you guys this one first, because this one's my least favorite, because it's basically just glitter. So it says G2 on it. Now, this one is in G2. Now, what I didn't realize is that when I was looking on the actual Shop My Save website, um, the ones that say G on it are basically glitter, <laughs> which I didn't, you know, think because I never really saw these before. So if you open it, I'm not going to tip it too much, but it's just glitter. Like, it's just glitter. That's it. So I could, like, throw this around and there'd be glitter everywhere. It's definitely not an eyeshadow. Like, you put your finger in it and you put it and it's, like, everywhere. It's bad. But now this one, this one is in 12 which is amazing. It's a, such a beautiful color. That is the color. It's the eyeshadow. It is crazy. It is so pigmented too. Like it's amazing. That was just by a little bit too. These two are really cool. I definitely want to get more of them. Um, definitely more of these ones and not the glitter ones. Um, now we have the lipsticks. I'm not swatching these. <laughs> definitely not in this video anyway. If you guys want to see swatches, let me know, like I said, but I'm not swatching in this video. I'm just not like. So these ones are by Clean Color, which these ones are pretty nice. So I have four of them. They kind of look the same color, but I guess on camera they really don't. So those are the colors. This is the first color. It doesn't say, it says the number, but it doesn't say the name. 1603, 1645, 1630, 1602. These ones are really pretty. They do stay very long. I've tested them before they do stay they kind of feel a little sticky though because they are matte but they're not bad First. then I have these ones these are by LA colors no these ones are by Santee so I have these three they're in matte long-lasting lip liquid liquid lipstick so like this they don't have the name of the colors or anything on them but it's purple red and nude so these ones are by Malibu Glitz. Let's do these three. So these ones are by Malibu Glitz. They're in four, three different purple shades. So they just look like this. So this one is in Vampy. This one's the darkest purple. And we have, and it's cool because it has the colors on top too. This one is in Berry. Berry. And it's just purple. Then this one is in Vamp, so there's Vamp and Vamp P. This one's more of a pink purple, and has a little bit of red in it too. So a red, a red purple, let's not say pink purple. I did get a lipstick. I did get a lipstick. This is the LA Colors lipsticks, and I wanted a black lipstick. Just black lipstick. Four of these. These are by LA Colors. These are the... Pout Lip Glosses. So I got four of these, four different colors. Oh wait, this I do. This is in XOXO. Grumptious. This one's in Kiss and Tell. This that one's more of a purple, definite purple. And then this one's a definite pink. And this one is in Let's Kiss. Two more here that I'm going to show you, which I do, I love these ones. These ones are really nice. These ones are Brad Muse. Um, these are the... They, they say that they're lip glosses and matte lip gloss, which I definitely tell because they are definitely liquidy. Um, but this one is in... One's in like a red. The other one's in like a pink. Here, Red. That one's really pretty. If you guys want to see some pictures of it, it's on my Instagram. And then there's pink. Which is more like a nude when you take it out. So that was the lipsticks that I had. Lip like liquid lipsticks whatever you want to call them that was from shop miss a so that was actually everything from shop miss a wow that was the first <laughs> okay now the next thing that i'm going to do is i'm going to do a quick little amazon haul because i did get a couple of makeup items from amazon i just got them a couple um it was after christmas but i bought them in like october um, so I'm going to show you guys a couple of those things as well. I also have a set of makeup brushes on them on their way. And then I bought this mirror too, which I'm going to show you because I have to turn off. But this is the mirror that I bought as well. Um, let's sit back here. So it has like the light. And it has the regular mirror. And then like the 
the magnifying mirror and it has two different like low light highlight bought more liquid lipsticks because I wanted to try these ones um, these ones supposedly stay forever they are matte again um, but I haven't tried them which I was going to try them but I didn't not yet so there is five of them Here's the five. Um, now there's two palettes missing because I gave some to my cousin for for Christmas again. Um, there's two for Mega Nudes, and then there's some from the W7 collection. So these are the this one is the first Mega Nudes palette, and then I have the number three, and I gave the number two to my cousin because that was the only one that wasn't broken. So if you're wondering why there's tape on these ones, it's because they were kind of broken. So this is the Mega Nudes 1 palette, which I love these palettes. I didn't realize how pigmented they were going to be, but I wanted to try them. So this is the first palette. This one's the number 3. This one has a lot more shimmery colors than the other one did. Um, but these ones is really pretty. They're so pretty. But yeah, it was broken here. Like there's actually a piece of the plastic missing. So I definitely put some of that here. Um, the brushes in these are actually really nice too. So I guess I should probably show you guys what they look like. So this is the smoking palette, which is nice. It actually even comes with the name of the colors in the back. So there's Royal Flush, Full House, Numero Uno, Mix and Match, Jupiter, Treasure Trove, blah, 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 blah. If you guys want to know more, go on Amazon. <laughs> or if you guys really want to know, if you want a more detailed thing of like a review of these, just let me know. Um, so this is the brush. So it comes with a sponge brush, but it also comes with like an actual eyeshadow brush. Which I thought was pretty cool. This is what they look like. They're very pretty, very pigmented. They're very shimmery too. And then there's four matte colors down here. So these are the four matte colors. So those are the four matte colors. And then all the rest of these are shimmery. And they are very pretty. This is the In the Night. It's just purple. And again, plastic. And then these are the colors. So they have a bunch of shimmery ones. There's not... The black one on the end here is matte, but that's the only one. Other than that, the rest are shimmery. A couple more things. So, the other day I got some of these brushes. These nail art brushes from Amazon as well, which come in a pack of 12, I believe. One. I'm pretty excited to use these. Um, I haven't used them yet, but I'm going to. Then I have this palette, which I'm going to show you guys very quickly, which I've been waiting for forever. Um... This is the Weenie Kia, I don't even know what, I'm not even going to pronounce that, Dazzle Bright 6 color eyeshadow palette. It's very pretty, it's very small, um, so this is what it looks like, it's very like crazy pretty. It's in the number 6, um, but they are very shimmery, like, and it has a really nice mirror, and these are what the colors look like. They're very sparkly, like very, very sparkly. I wasn't expecting the palette to be this small, um, but it is very pretty, and I'm very excited to use it. So if you guys want to see that, definitely let me know. So that was everything that I bought from Amazon, and I'm shocked to say, I knew this video was probably going to be really long. Um, but yeah, that was everything, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And there are definitely going to be more videos on the way, but let me know if you guys want to see swatch videos. Also, what else you guys want to see, so definitely let me know, leave a comment down below, and give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And yeah, we'll see you guys really soon.